Hey guys, tonight I'm actually going to show you how to calculate the volume of a rectangular swimming pool. Alright, so first things first, let's draw our swimming pool. Now, let's imagine this is 20 feet, this length is 10 feet, and this length is 8 feet. Now, how are we going to do this? Well, the best way to do it is multiply your length by width, 20 times 10, and then you're going to multiply that number by your average depth. And this pool is a complete rectangle, so your average depth is 8 feet. You multiply that by 8, and then you'll get your total, which is 1,600, and that will be in cubic feet. So what we need to do to make that gallons is multiply by 7.5, and that will equal 12,000 gallons. So this swimming pool here is a 12,000 gallon swimming pool. Now you're saying, that's all well and good, Mark, except I have a sloped pool. I have a shallow end and a deep end here. How do I figure that out? Well, we want to figure out the average depth here. These numbers are going to be the same. So we're still going to do 20 times 10. And then we're going to go, well, what is this number here? Well. The average depth, because this is a constant slope, is going to be your 8 plus your 2, which is equal to 10, and then you're going to divide that by 2, and that's going to get your average depth of 5 feet. So we'll multiply that into our equation here, and, and that's going to be 1,000, and we're going to go ahead and multiply our 1,000 by 7.5 to get our gallons which is 7,500 gallons for our sloped rectangular swimming pool. Alright guys now you know how to do the volume of a sloped and a non-sloped rectangular swimming pool. Uh, maybe tomorrow or later this week we'll do a uh, multi-slope so you have a flat partial and then maybe an up something like that. Um, we'll do something volume wise like that probably. Um, maybe we'll do a circular spa or a circular pool and then maybe some other equations for some odd shapes like kidney, kidney pools things like that uh, and, and go from there. Cool. Hope you guys are having a great night. Uh, comment below with more questions, things that you want to see.